Template Monster presents. Hey there. People often ask me how to create a business website. Um, by business websites, we usually mean the static six page website. Uh, with a uh, fixed subset of pages. Uh, these pages normally include the home page, the contacts page, the about page. Uh, the additional sub pages may vary. For example, they may be the team page, our services, what we do, uh, etc. Uh, so the point is that uh, these pages do not get updated very often. I mean, you don't have uh, a blog content on them, you don't have a shopping cart, you don't have the, uh, the comment section, for example. That's why these pages are called static pages. Since they're static, uh, this is actually an important thing. Uh, I'll tell you why in a minute. Uh, since these pages are static, uh, you may build a business website with, a, with the most straightforward way that's available out there. Uh, from the HTML template. That's, uh, that's the most simple and the most uh, affordable kind of template available on the market. Uh, but uh, let's take a look at this whole thing from the cost's point of view. Uh, since there are two big ways of creating a website uh, from a downloadable template and with a subscription-based service, um, you may think of it as... Uh, two big ways that are very much different in, uh, uh, in terms of the costs. Uh, the downloadable template is obviously the cheapest way because the, uh, the plain HTML and CSS uh, templates are priced at around $50 per a lifetime license. Uh, and um, uh, the good thing about them is that you uh, do it once and you forget it forever. Uh, so it's a, a one-time effort. Uh, the downside is that you do need to have some, at least some basic HTML or CSS uh, skills or at least some understanding of, of these languages. Uh, and uh, you do need uh, to buy a hosting and a domain name. That's also not too much expensive, around uh, $50 a year. Uh, but still, you do need that. Um, <clears throat> actually, if you don't want to mess with the... Uh, with the HTML code, you may purchase a CMS-based uh, template, like uh, a WordPress template, for example, or a Joomla template. Uh, they will be slightly more expensive, around uh, $75 per license, but still, uh, this is uh, a lot cheaper than the subscription-based, uh, than using the subscription-based service. Uh, with, the, with this subscription-based services, also known as SaaS, uh, you get it a, uh, a website where everything is included. I mean, you have the admin panel, you have uh, the hosting that's already there. You may easily uh, configure the, the domain name, the custom one. Uh, that is, uh, of course, that's very convenient. Um, the downside of this option is that it's a lot more expensive. Uh, since you pay on a monthly basis, uh, for example, like nine or ten dollars a month, uh, after uh, after a year, uh, this option becomes uh, more expensive than the first one. Uh, not to mention the second year or the third year, and, and so on. Uh, the other significant downside of the SaaS option is that you have less control over the uh, the functionality and uh, and your website in general. Uh, since everything is limited uh, with the, the admin panel and you don't have the access to the source code uh, or to the, uh, the, like the template files, uh, you're not exactly able to change a lot of uh, elements on your website. And uh, uh, the next significant thing about the SaaS option is that it's uh, less technically advanced in terms of what you get as a result. Uh, because the website that you, uh, 
that you get with with this kind of service may be uh, significantly uh, more heavyweight and may take a lot more time to load uh, than the the plain HTML website. Uh, and uh, the code may be messy, uh, which uh, which is what uh, search engines don't really appreciate. So you have to be uh, be, be careful about that as well. Um, so I hope this answers the question. Uh, the business websites are static, so uh, the most uh, rational option for building them is with a simple and cheap template. Uh, that's going to be a lot more uh, efficient for you ultimately than the other uh, kinds of options. So that's that's the bottom line. Uh, see you next time. Bye bye. Do you want to get an answer to any question regarding webmastering and getting your business online? Visit templatemonster.com/startup-hub to learn how you can bring your ideas to life.